Hello, I'm Richard and here are today's headlines from Pink 60. A British woman has been formally named as the only fatality to date of the helicopter crash which happened in New York City earlier this week. The woman who lived in Australia was one of five people on board the aircraft when it came down. The teenager accused of killing a classmate in California will be retried after the original trial failed to produce a verdict. Last month, the jury in the trial of McInerney failed to reach a verdict, forcing the presiding judge to rule a mistrial. Religious leaders have criticised David Cameron's public backing for gay marriage. Giving his keynote speech at the Conservative Party conference in Manchester yesterday, Mr Cameron urged the party to back the move because of its conservatism, not in spite of it. Gay rights campaigners in South Africa say a fifth gay murder in Johannesburg suggests there may be a homophobic killer at large. In the last year, there have been four cases in which gay men were found dead in similar circumstances. And finally, Evan Rachel Wood says her bisexuality is for real. The True Blood actress, who has dealt firmly with suggestions that her orientation is a phase, told GQ she had been attracted to men and women since she could remember. That's all from us today. Join us again tomorrow.